in the industry, we look at things at how much, how many tons of things need to come into the space. So we did this shoot with a panel van and a cube van. And to provide a park, it would be a five, two five ton loads of stuff. My job is to source and supply the physical elements that we'll be using for the set and then hand them over to visual effects to be scanned and put into the asset so our benches and you know anything that we put in the set matches the uh, asset. The same massive, creative, immersive environments that you'd wanted to create all along now you can actually do it, but at the highest quality, real-time fidelity that only could be dreamed of back in the day. Like we had to think about how our elements would work in that virtual field. So it gave me something else to think about rather than just we're building a set, we're, we're building part of the set, the foreground with the actors interact, their world. You know, it's, it's always a space for actors. You're, you're creating a space for actors to work. And that's why our physical elements are really important with the digital technology. The actors still need to feel like they're in the space and they need to feel that for their characters. As a production designer, every art department that's out there really needs to pay attention to this emerging technology. It's going to be an indispensable tool for any production that wants to have studio level control but have the range of opportunities of going to locations that are beyond that, which you can attain even in real life. I, I, you know, it just opens up more possibilities and it makes it easier for production, I think, to get more quality and higher quality and better experience for the audience, which is ultimately why we're all in the industry. Every major participant in the industry in Toronto and really in Canada has come together in a unified way and work together to make this workshop a success. And because of all those actively engaged participants and organizations, we got the best of the best this weekend and look out because there's more coming. <laughs>